Hello and welcome to another lesson. Um, today I want to talk about a few things. Well, first is the redirect manager. This is a cool feature that Joomla 2.5 has that wasn't available in the previous versions. And with this feature, what how it works is that sometimes you have certain pages that have a 404 page, and what that means is that somehow you might have you know change the link to that page that it's not the same and when someone goes to that page it gives an error something like this this is the page that used to work but once I go in there it's giving this full for error saying that page uh, category page cannot be found and this is very problematic because if your website has a lot of errors then the search engine can you know sometimes penalize you for it because they're trying to look for that page but they can't find it and not just the search engines but also people it's very frustrating sometimes when you go to certain websites or you're searching for things online and you find this link that you think you, this is what you've been looking for and you click on it and you get a 404 page well where, what happened to that page it's not there anymore and the site administrator forgot to redirect or update you what happened to that particular page so to avoid that is all the pages Every time there's a link that you've changed and you you know that's shown the 404 page, Joomla is automatically going to you know log that on the back end for you. So if you go to components and you go to redirect, Joomla is going to show you all the links that are you know coming up as not being found. And what you can do in this instance is you can redirect those links to a new page or to a different website. So I have this one right now that's showing this 404 page. So I am going to redirect this to a different URL. So I'm just going to click on it. Now this is the source URL and I have to have a destination URL. So I have to send this to go somewhere so that when someone comes to that page and they are they can't find that particular information I have to redirect them to somewhere else so I'm going to put in com. and you want to make sure that the status status is enabled so click on that save and close So that the next time someone clicks on this link, now if I go back on this page and I refresh this link, now if I come on this page, the four front page, let me, and if I enter that URL that I was having problems with, notice what's going to happen. It's been redirected to a different website. So that's a really, really handy feature that you really have to take advantage of it. So if you have a lot of links that are broken, that are not working, you want to make sure that you redirect those somewhere else so that you don't get penalized for it and you know people don't get frustrated trying to find stuff on your website. So that's how you set it up and it's so easy and straight to the point.